Hey, this is Sasha from NetworkNews.com. Uh, we are at the Uplink conference and we're playing this good old uh, Rock'em Sock'em Robots game from Mattel. That's actually the mid-60s original version of it. Oh, I just got beaten up over here by Brad from Mattel. And, um, but you know what? They're also showing something really cool based on the Snapdragon devices and uh, with a little bit, not only a little bit, but with lots of augmented reality. Let's take a look at this. So now we are here with Andrew from Mattel, and he's going to show us the new uh, Rock and Sock, Sock and Rock'em? Rock'em Sock'em. Rock'em so, Sock'em Roberts. So I'm Andrew Cheeseman with Mattel. This is uh, this is my HTC, uh, my HTC Incredible. You can see it's just a camera, and here on the ground, you see that we printed up a target. Normally, we the targets that we actually use in the office are just a regular size sheet of paper, but this is a conference, so we decided we'd go big. <laughs> so when you look through the camera and you point it, oops, when you look through the camera and you don't hit the volume button and you point it at the target, what you'll see is that the uh, is that robots appear, not robots and a boxing ring appear right here, and and it's as though the robots were right there. So I can actually zoom in and look at the robots detail. I can look at his eyes, right? <laughs> I can I can look at the detail on him even though there's no actual robot there, but the camera thinks that there is. Or you would you might think that there is by looking at the camera at any rate. So I can control the robot. I'm the blue robot here and I can walk forward. And notice I have to actually pan the camera because the robot is walking over to the right side of the target. So let's move over here. So part of the way you play this game is in order to get the right perspective to keep playing, you, uh, you move around the target. So I'm going to punch him like that. And I have a little misaligned. Let's, uh, let's punch him again. Let me get in a little closer. And I'll do a quick jab, jab. So I can pretty much knock him completely out. So let's take care of him once and for all. <laughs> there you go. And so there's the ro uh, I lost the target. That's how that's how you play the game. So part Fantastic. of the game, the game is really about moving the robot around um, and strategizing where you're going to be as the other robot moves when you're playing the two-player game. If so th this is used to run on an Android device with a Snapdragon platform. That's right. So it runs on, and it runs on the uh, Qualcomm SDK. Okay. That is uh, that Qualcomm just announced this morning will be uh, released in fall. Fantastic. Do you know when we can get this game as an app or? So uh, this is a technology demonstration project that you're looking at. Yeah. Um, at this point, it's not a product, so we'll keep you posted. Okay, fantastic. This is Sasha for NetbookNews.com at the Uplink 2010 with Andrew from Mattel and playing Rock'em Sock'em. Great, thank you very much. Thank you.